Hey guys, gonna make this one quick. As you can see, I've got homebrew on tap. This is the cornbread and fed cream ale. It's not real clear. And from that pour, it was kind of aggressive, so the head has died down some. Uh, this one uh, doesn't keep a whole lot of a head on there, but it's got excellent head retention, uh, which is nice. Sorry, I keep cutting my head off there. Kind of tough to find a spot for the camera to sit. Um, not a whole lot going on this Wednesday, just because I've been uh, busy visiting with some family that came up to see the house. But tomorrow, if an opportunity presents itself, I'm going to get to the Fat Tire clone. Uh, I think I'm just going to go straight to a keg with that one. It should be pretty clear. It's been sitting in primary. I'm not going to do a secondary on it just so I can get it out of the way. Um, and then I'm going to harvest the yeast from it. I found uh, some mason jars today. I think it was like 7 bucks for 8 no, there were more than that. Twelve mason jars. So I got plenty of those to do some yeast washing and harvesting. Uh, so I'm going to harvest that American Ale yeast and hopefully be able to use it a few more times. Um, but yeah, anyway, the cream ale, we'll talk about this for a minute since I don't have much to chat about. Uh, it's pretty good. Uh, it's not clear, so next time uh, I brew it, which will be soon, I'm going to work on that. And uh, the other big thing with it is it's got a way I put too much corn in it. Um, yeah, you're supposed to have that corn, a little bit of a corn flavor in there, uh, cooked corn, because uh, it's just what the style call for, calls for. But uh, this one, way too much. So I'm going to cut that down to a half a pound next time instead of a full pound. And I'm also going to up it to a 90-minute boil because I did use a Pilsner malt in here. See, oh. It's good. I, I really had no complaints, but I, I want to tweak it and fine-tune it. That's where I'm really at anymore with brewing. Uh, I just want to fine-tune it and get it where I'm happy. But anyway, I'm sitting out back at home here. I'm going to enjoy this. Spend some time with the wife, and I hope everyone has a good homebrew Wednesday. Cheers.